The video title is something big is happening. Let's check it out. This one has been trending all Drop weekend. The, the story up. from meteorologist Ben Gelber about an astronomical event that has never happened before. Next Tuesday, November 8th, will be the first total lunar eclipse on Election Day in U.S. history. The total. Have you seen that? I personally did not see it. Eclipse will be visible eyes, for a few hours before daybreak, low in the western sky, weather permitting, of course. The celestial event occurs when the Earth is between the sun and the moon, blocking out sun sunlight from reaching the lunar surface, which is instead covered by the Earth's shadow. Pretty spooky, Damn. Brad. That can't be good that it's happening a full... I mean, God got way too much time on his hand, Bruh. man. He'd be aligning everything together. Damn, man, that's Tips wild. On election day. NASA captured this image of what looks like a smiley face on the sun. You see what? that there? NASA says this could be a warning sign. Oh, really? A warning sign? Hey, of what? Ow! Ow! Repent now! Is the end times but listen man that looks actually wild you got like two eyes you got like that's mouth that's kind of like the nose and that's like the round face damn son. Ash, Ash. well it's uh nasa says the image of that sun in ultraviolet light featuring those three dark patches that look like a smiling face could signal a solar storm which could present problems or maybe that's just uh, god laughing at us on how dumb we are right yeah. maybe that's just sun laughing at like our tiktok generation i'm just saying man i'm uh, just saying geomagnetic storms can disrupt gps and create harmful currents in the power grid in the pipelines no laughing matter no smiling it does look like a jack-o-lantern. It does right look now. like a jack-o-lantern. a little suspicious of the timing, but... <laughs> right, exactly. It's just God laughing at you right now. Bro. All right, this image here may seem beautiful, right? But astronomers say it is absolutely terrifying. That brightly lit what? object is called a planet killer. It's a massive asteroid orbiting near Earth. It's more than a mile wide and until now had been undetected. One scientist says an asteroid that... That's uh, like some people would say like wrong. wrong one mile. That's actually small. But man, if that hits... Dang, Big hitting Earth would quote be a mass extinction event not seen on Earth in millions of years. I don't Scientists that. say it would not happen for centuries, if at all. Oh, Astronomers expect to find more planet killing asteroids over the next couple of years. Right now, none is on a collision with co uh, collision course with Earth. Earlier this week, scientists announced a mile-wide asteroid was discovered in the inner solar system flying within the orbits of Earth and Venus. Meanwhile, people are like, the Earth is flat. Wrong. Wrong. The, the, the space don't exist. Now, if you're curious as to how something a mile wide flying through space that's been dubbed a planet killer could go undetected until this week, well, I think it is fair to say that you are not alone. Yeah, honestly, that's that type of stuff is actually kind of wild, right? Like jokes aside, I'm not trying to mock anybody's belief or anything like that, even though I just kind of did. But that's just sarcasm, right? Sarcasm. I'm not like uh, I'm, I still respect anyone that believes in like space doesn't exist, whatever, right? Like I believe it exists. If you don't, whatever, right? Like I'm gonna let you do you. But the thing that I'm saying here is that the thing that's kind of wild is that there's stuff getting discovered every single day and how much of it is told to the public how much of it is true how much because like i would like to believe that aliens exist right i know some of right. you are like nah man they don't exist uh, but i would like to believe that they exist when are we gonna get that disclosure right like is it gonna happen after something actually hit us is it gonna happen before i really hope it happens before i mean damn son like come on man let's tell everybody Researchers say they have found a potentially life-threatening asteroid hiding in the glare of the sun. A team of international astronomers have discovered three new near-Earth asteroids. Damn. Two have orbits that won't intersect with Earth's, but oh, a God. third, a one-and-a-half kilometer wide chunk of space rock, could someday cross our path. This comes just weeks after NASA deliberately crashed a probe into an asteroid, the first full-scale test of asteroid deflection technology okay thank god man thank god we're getting some technology like that but click on this video on the screen we got some wild discoveries by nasa like all our aliens coming click on this video and i will see you right there subscribe